Hi, it's Pat Crone for the Real Football Network, and the wild card weekend is over. I'm going to take a hard look at some of the things that happened and maybe give us some clues to the divisional round. First off, all four home teams lost, but all four home teams had quarterbacks with zero playoff experience. Now, the first thing those veteran teams did when they came in with their teams with all those playoff experience by those quarterbacks is they did what? They stuffed the run game. Between the four teams that lost, they average 87 yards rushing, not very good. The teams that won, they average about 110 yards rushing. And there's one big difference, shifting the game into the hands of the young quarterback. So guys like A.J. McCarron and uh, Teddy Bridgewater, they had a hard day. They threw 195 passes between the four of them. They threw two touchdown passes. That's not going to get it done. You got 87 yards rushing, and between the four of them, they generate two passing touchdowns. Look. They're going to be good players. I think A.J. McCarron's going to be good. I think Teddy Bridgewater's going to be good, but not yet. So what happens now? Well, Aaron Rodgers, Russell Wilson, Ben Roethlisberger, if he's healthy, Alex Smith, move on. Between those four guys, they have a record of 28 and 14 in the postseason. And they have an even more impressive record of 12 and 7 on the road in the postseason. None of them have a losing record on the road. Ben's the best of all at 5-2. and two. Well, who are they up against? 